What's up, motherfuckers? It is the 16th of the 8th, 2023. Check in. 8. Let's get into it. Good things, good news. And some update on some previous goals. We've got a fridge. We've got drawers for inside my room for clothes. We've also got some more drawers for inside the kitchen for some more storage. The cats are also outside. I cleaned up my old OF modeling Instagram thing. So I'll be reintroducing that out into the public soon as just a modeling portfolio. I've got a medical, you know, consultation today. I've still been getting on the gains. And I've also been trying to fix up my Seno because I was doing a dodgy for a second. And now we're trying to clean it up. I'm still on those Malfun gains with my cool friend. Very cool friend. She's also going to help me get qualified as a gymnastics coach. She said it's really easy so that I can earn more at jumps, which is very, very exciting. Because it's just lack of qualification that's stopping me from teaching kids one-on-one -on -one and stuff and being able to earn even more. So that's really hype. Um, my eating's been a lot better than it was in the last video. I found out about chicken breast steaks. These are my new favorite thing. You can get 100 grams of chicken, protein chicken breast, for like $10.50 from Woolies. It's the greatest thing ever. The other thing that I found was actual chicken mince. You can get a half kilo of chicken mince for $5.50. You can get well over 100 grams of protein for $5.50 of meat. That's so good, right? And so if I end up eating that, eating a tuna rice and then having some eggs, I'm looking at potentially $10, $12 of food per day, right? $150 a fortnight. That's so cheap right for all the protein intake intake that i need and then just filling it in little bits and pieces around with you know some snacks and stuff if i can calculate the snacks that will be proper mosey meals shout out to hashtag mosey nation that's sort of like what's been going on now it's uh this is what is gonna go down go down i've got more driving lessons booked i got one for the 23rd book one for the 28th book which is a little far away that's okay because at least it's on the schedule and it'll be about getting back into the groove of things since moving because we were in the groove of things a little bit before we moved and now that we moved gotta get back into the groove of things so we're gonna groove i'll be applying for an exemption i've got mum and dad on board i'll be applying for an exemption and once i get the exemption then i won't have to do the full 100 hours to get my license um i'll just have to pass the test which is really cool because the 100 hours was going to be very complicated and expensive however if i can get an exemption it's not so complicated and not so expensive to be hot i'm really gonna be <clears throat> focusing in on getting a car and license i would like to say that i've got it in the next two months that might be way too unrealistic in the next three months is what i want to tell myself i can do realistically but it's probably closer to six months however i'm still gonna race myself and figure out how to do it in three months two months even that'd be really cool because what do i need to do get competent at driving so increase driving skill get access to motorized vehicle motorized vehicle is done through money which is income which is working which is trading time for effort right or sorting out some sort of contract or business deal or something right where i can get a car whatever and then doing the test and getting it done right. bang 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 that's all you need to drive all right i just never focus on those things enough i would like wider teeth i was smiling next to a friend look even next to this i would like my teeth slightly unnaturally white I reckon slightly unnaturally white teeth are like almost like a status symbol. Like, you know, when you see someone with white teeth and you're like, fuck, your teeth are white. And then you feel bad about your teeth. That's how I want other motherfuckers to feel. <laughs> Quitting smoking is orbiting my head again. And for any asteroid to crash onto Earth first, it must orbit. So now that that thought is orbiting again, I've got some positive reasons as to why I should not set. I could probably outline them a little bit further for myself just to make it easier. But... I'll probably end up because, you know, I'm session with Brock and stuff. And that doesn't usually occur all the time. Um, however, he would like to be off of it at one point. I would also like to be off it at one point. It's just something that needs to get done anyway. All right, cool. Let's go into what we want to do. All right, I want to clean up my life. Make it legal with taxes and shit. That's what I was doing with, like, Seno a little bit. But I'm also ready to, like, face whatever repercussions I got to face for, like, doing whatever I've been doing for the last, you know, few years with, like, not doing taxes and shit because of OF and Senna. Anyways, shh, don't tell anyone. I swear if this video, for whatever reason, just all of a sudden gets hella views. Meow. Meow. Hey Lenny. I would like to reduce my wardrobe. I've still got quite a few clothes here. I don't see much use for most of them. I want to get a bunch of these. These are my favorite, these thermal shirt things. I want to live in these. I want to live in these, find some shorts that fit. I've got my, my sandals, my dandles, 
my BC 500s, my back straps, and I keep those things on me. I've got those for my feet and white socks. I like that look. I like the white socks and sandals. It's a cool look. I'm gonna find some shorts, get these thermos. And then what I'm thinking is like thermo plus a jump bar or a button up or something. And then my Tommy Hilfiger jacket. And then I'll pretty much be what I wear all the time because that's what I like to wear all the time anyway. It's super fucking comfortable. My go-to outfit. I want to get my gymnastics qualifications as I previously spoke before about. But yeah, that's pretty much it. The goal is pretty simple at the moment, if you ask me. I think the goal is pretty simple at the moment. It's increase money earning potential with qualifications and side hustles and things. The next thing is save money, right? License, car, investments, savings, all that jazz, right? Eat lots of cheap protein, lots of cheap proteins. We want to get gains, but we want to save money, right? So eat lots of cheap protein, get gains. You know, we want to get gains. That's one of the goals at the moment. Uh, we want to develop some good habits and we also want to just push for the license and stuff and forming good habits of things like waking up and going to bed at the right time being disciplined with my showering and my teeth brushing um <laughs> hey i clean my bed every day i just don't necessarily take a shower every night and i would like to take a shower every night and so that's what i mean about good habits and things just things that i'm not doing that i would like to do like i don't have a skincare routine it'd be nice to have a skincare routine but yeah that is check-in eight it's actually amazing to see how far i've already come and grown from the first check-in to this check-in the first check-in was about optimizing how much money I was going to earn on OF. And now this check-in is about getting my gymnastics qualifications, you know, hanging out with a really cool friend, getting gains, you know, like that's the point of this series. That's the idea just to see. And so that like, I've got a document of what happened. You guys can see how I go about it. You guys can see how I like monitor my goals. I don't know, maybe it helps someone. Um, I love you all. Have fun. Stay safe. If you watch to the end of the video, and you want to tell me about your goals that are coming up. I would love to hear them. Give me a little bit of encouragement. But yeah, you've got this. Have fun. Stay safe. Here's some encouragement. Don't like the video. Don't subscribe. I don't care. Or you can do those things. It'd be cool. Anyways, I love you all. Have fun. Stay safe. Bye. Love you, mum. Love you, dad. Bye.